Today, I'm going to show you how to connect to the Mendocino College Wi-Fi with a Windows 10 machine uh, using your student Gmail account. Come over to your wireless selection network, and you're going to choose Mendo Onboard. When you use Mendo Onboard, it should either open up a window for you. Uh, you'll be able to continue through the process here. But if you're using Chrome or Edge, I recommend using an in private window and connecting to onboard.mendocino.edu. That will prevent any issues from arising uh, from conflicting accounts. And when the first page you're gonna get is the terms of use, you will have to accept them in order to con continue. You will then select student. Today we're doing Gmail. Here you're going to enter your student email address, which is first name, period, last name, at student.mendocino.edu. When you select next, it will take you to our portal page. Here, you're going to put in your first name, dot last name, without the student.mendocino.edu, along with your password, and select login. When you get to this page, you're going to name your device. I always recommend that you name a device for everything that you put on so that you know what it is and what is connecting. So for here, we're going to put school laptop. That way you know that it is the laptop that we have gotten from the college. And then you're going to download the exe file for Windows. You have the option to use the zip, but I highly recommend using the exe file because it'll do all of the configuration for you. You'll have to accept <clears throat> the ability to install the exe file because exe files from the internet are generally not considered safe. And then it will go through this process of downloading the configuration files and certificates. You'll get this window. It has two checkboxes. Um, the first checkbox is to tell you it has a certificate and wants to install it. We're going to say yes. The second one is then reaching out to the network to configure the computer for connecting to your network. You get your second checkbox. You can see that you have it. It tells you what IP address you have, and you will be on the Mendocino network. So anytime you come to the college, you will see that you are on the Mendocino network. It works in Willits, Fort Bragg, Lake Center, and Ukiah. 